Yeah. What we have here is a stretch sensor. It's a woven fabric with a sensing capability of stress. We uh, use it in a device that measures the oedema in the leg. It's expansion of, uh, of the leg volume due to liquid fluid. It's an early warning on heart failure. You uh -huh. also know it when you are flying. You will have a lot of water in your legs. It's a similar. Uh, and at a certain time when there's sufficient stress on the fabric, the sock here, it will send a, a warning to, uh, to the hospital that they need to interfere. So that's a way of making So this is a medical device? This is a medical device, yeah, exactly. So what, what kind of sensor do you put in there? What's we, the, what sort we, of material? We put the sensor, yeah. and then there's an electronic module, which is in this version just the prototype here. Uh, we, will, we will make it much s smaller but it contains a Bluetooth module and the sensing of the, the strain. Is it a special material that you use for making this fibers? We use uh, constant end wires, which are also used on measuring vibration in large machinery. But this is a uh, very, very thin. It's uh, only 50 micron uh, uh, thick uh, wire, so it's very difficult to, to see. Uh, maybe we can. Uh... Yeah. Okay. So, what are, we, what are we looking at there? This one here. Yeah. Yeah. This is a skin sensor. Yeah, it has very thin silver uh, threads moved up to the top of the fabric. So when you put it to the skin, you have a very good contact. Uh, it's a substitution for dry electrodes, which contains a gel. What are you showing here on the on the wall? Uh, uh, what we're showing is that often, okay, yeah. often people are not just buying our products, but uh, they they are not really uh, sure about how the concept should look like. So we offer a feasibility study where we can go all the way from the identification of the customer needs to the product development, to the garment integration, which is a new discipline in, in electronics. And we go to prototype and complete developments. So, so are you in space or are you just are, saying it could go in? This, this sock is a device that measures the astronaut's muscle activity. It's used uh, light sensors that expose the skin with light and then there is a uh, photo detector here so that in the moment where you have it on the skin it measures the oxygenation which is more or less uh, what's needed to know how much blood there is in and around it's the muscle. It's similar to what uh, Microsoft and Apple is doing? Uh... Yeah, it's, it's uh, similar to watches and it's also known from uh, pulse oximetry mm -hmm. That is very, very common. How precise is it? It's, it's, uh, it can measure the percentages of uh, the blood and the oxygen in and around the blood. Uh, while it's a space device, it's very much related to the way the astronauts are training. So it's uh, calibrated on Earth and then when they go to the space station, they can use this device as an indication of how much they have trained. If they save training, they can use that for scientific experiments and stuff. And you, you want to uh, also be in uh, for the safety consumer. Yeah. What's the safety about? The, the safety, I don't know. I don't have um, a product with me. The product, but we are making a heat sensing, a heat sensor on the shoulder and the sleeve label, so it can predict uh, heat stress, which is a very dangerous. Um, situation for uh, for firefighters so how big is this market uh, how many are you selling we don't so far? Know. <laughs> we don't know you're just selling few so far and it could be huge in the future uh, and where are you based we, we, we know we know we know there's only 15 15 astronauts so that's a small market but, so there but is this, 15 of these in space or there has been there will be there will be there will be but but we are doing this on contract for the european space agency 
So uh, it, it doesn't depend on how many we are selling. It's more the, the level of, of uh, contracting and the preciseness in the measurement that are counts you, from... Are you from we're Denmark? From, we're from Denmark. Yeah. Denmark, okay. Yeah. All right, okay. So Thank you very much. Okay.